Hey YouTube, it's Elgin here. Welcome back to an episode of Pokemon Black. Oh my god. So last episode we actually started, well, we actually completed the, the, the majority of the desert. I tried to backpack on me to travel in trainer. Fight me, fight me, bro. But yeah, we're actually heading north to Nimbasa City today. Don't know when we get done, but Nimbasa City is, uh, it's one of those cities, like, cities I always go, Nimbasa City, Nimbasa City. I don't know why I always have to say it that manner. I, I, like, even when I did this play, this, this game, when it first came out in 2011, I, um, I actually always said Nimbasa City like that, Nimbasa City. No idea why. <laughs> no idea why, but yep, that was a pretty easy fight. Buzzing. And yeah, she, she had a nice pit of. But yeah, we're just gonna keep heading north to Nimbasa City. And uh, yeah, it's been um, it's been an interesting few hours. Oh my god. Is that Professor Juniper? What's up, Sharon? Hello, Dan. Come here. Oh yeah, wait, I'm pretty sure we were told to actually meet here. Elsa called Elsa called and was asking them about all electric Pokemon. And I thought, I tell you guys, that's why I wanted to see you. Free for you. Here, Charon. Here, you two down. And we got some Ultra Balls for free. Buzzing. Not complaining. If you want a Pokemon that, that... If you see a Pokemon that you want to join you, make sure you have a good type of Pokeball. Because this could be the first and last time you see that Pokemon. I.e. Legendary Pokemon. I know it may seem strange for me to ask, since I'm the one who asks you to complete the Pokedex. But please remember to enjoy your journey. And of course... I'm not saying you can just neglect your Pokédex, but you know. Now, if you see me, if you, if you please excuse me, I have to go and meet Bianca. So yeah, obviously Bianca's going to be behind us. So uh, well, like she's at least. We got some free Pokéballs cheering. I'm buzzing. It seems that the professor gave us a Pokédex as a reason to send on a journey. At least that's what my mom told me. They wanted us to go out and see the world. So my mom, Bianca's mom, and your mom made a request to Professor Juniper. Oh, that's so nice. Dan, what do you want to do now? I think I'd like to show my professor. Uh, I'd like to show Professor my thanks by going to Route 4 and catching some Pokemon I haven't caught yet. Bye. We're heading north no matter what. But yeah, it's so nice we actually got like 10 free Pokeballs. I'm not happy. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. But welcome to Nimbasa City. Oh my god. Team Plasma's already here. Gramps, we know you you run the daycare. How do we know? Because we're Team Plasma. We are taking Pokemon away from people. Since you work at the daycare, we figure that you must have a lot of Pokemon. Hand them over. What kind of nonsense is this? See, the DK man is actually, like, he, he actually likes to help Pokemon level them up and to just, like, let them roam free, you know, like, free-range animals. Oh, a strong like a trainer, please help me. Oh, but I'll let yell. If you're going to get in, in the way, we'll take your Pokemon too. And, of course, we're fighting good old Team Plasma. Oh, we can never get away from him. But, yeah, I do like Team Plasma, and it's going to be a grunt. He's going to send out a Watchdog, level 18. And, uh, of course, like, since we took a, a detour into, um the uh, previous route we're actually higher level than most of these pokemon like level 18 has got nothing on on us as you can see one shot nice one dakma proud here to an experience and he's also sent out a trubbish which is a piece of rubbish i can't I, a lot of people slag off rubbish because it is like a literally garbage but and i don't know why but a lot of people do hate it and i can i can i can see the ideas but i also think it's like a unique pokemon they are running out of ideas slowly like since there is like up to the seventh generation now which is crazy and he lost uh, Plasma. What? This this went downhill fast. So I think we better run. Let's head out, let's head out of the amusement park. Okay. It looks like we know where we're headed now. Jesus Christ! Thank you so much. Please say this is a cut on my graduate gra uh, gratification. It's a brand new bike. I've always planned on riding around in Bassasse, but never ended up riding it. So yeah, we got a free bicycle. Whoa, hey. And uh, we're gonna put it into our key items. I have a day on Route Three. If you have any Pokemon you want to raise, please do them off. I just came to. Sightsee, but I got in a lot of trouble. Goodbye, my young power one. Dan, yoohoo! What's up, Bianca? How you doing? The professor told me Nimbasa City has a lot of things to do and see. The music part, the big stadium, small court, and the battle stadium. I'm gonna go and see the Pokemon musical. I'll see you soon. Okay, bye, bye. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually put on, um, what's it called? I need to get the right keys again. I keep pressing the wrong buttons. We wanted to go and put the bicycle onto our quick select. So where is the bike? Because the bike is just so useful. Okay, there we go. Use. I didn't even actually register. Just give me a second. I need to register it. Because the bicycle is so useful. Register. There we go. And now we can just like quickly. I think it's A. We can we can use a mixture of both the bicycle and the dowsing machine. Well, hey. But first off, we're gonna go and actually stock up on repels as well as heal our Pokemon and get a spawn point here. So uh, what do you guys say? Please sell yourself some decent repels. Please sell some repels. Yes. We're not going to buy 99 because that's a bit overkill. I think we're going to buy 25 for, for now. And then we're going to get some revives. 
before we go exploring. Because if you, if you remember, Team Plasma did run off to the um, amusement park. Well, we just found that out now. So we're going to go and chase them down. We're going to get 18 revives. Because revives are actually pretty key. I'm going to save the rest of our money. And let's set up our spawn point here. So, uh, what up, Nurse Joint? Thank you. Would you like me to heal your Pokemon? Yes, I would. There you go. Heal my Pokemon, please. And there we go. That's going to give us back to full HP. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon is back, back to full HP. No problem. So now what we're going to do is we're going to, first off, head to the museum. Uh, the mu musical. Because that's where Bianca is. And I feel like it's key for us to actually get with her, you know. Because she is a nice person. So where is the musical? Is this the musical? Oh my god, is that a, an NFL player? Big stadium. We're not going to go there. Here we go. The musical theater. Let's go, Bianca. How you doing? Oh, Dan. You're interested in musicals? Let, let's go in together. Yes, let's. And I don't know what's going to happen, but we're going to wait to watch a musical, I guess. Oh, what the hell is this? Um, ama amazing, isn't it? Oh my god, who's this random guy? Hello, you two. How'd you do? I'm the owner of this theater. Pleasure to meet you. Hello, how you doing? Oh, I must say, you team seem like phenomenal trainers. What do we do? We use props to make your Pokemon fashionable and glorious. Do you want to join in and play a dress-up game? If you get started, here's a prop case. Okay, uh, it seems a bit weird, but okay. It looks like we're going to actually get to dress up our Pokemon. You put the prop case in your key items. The prop case lets you store props for decorating your Pokemon. First off, you need to pick a Pokemon, which I'm going to pick Dusty. There you go, Dusty. Enjoy. It it's time to play dress-up. And, uh, oh my god, this is on the bottom screen. Uh, I can't really show you this, but we have to, like, okay. Looks like using the stylus to drag stuff on it. It's kind of trying, trying to give us a tutorial. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to put anything on. I'm just going to put it straight through because it's kind of making us do this. I guess I get it. You're expressing your Pokemon in it, in in it, in in it charm by choosing not to decorate it. Yep. Honestly, I thought using props would be received for the musical. If a Pokemon who can play dress up, you can participate in the Pokemon musical. Would you two join us in the reception so I can explain everything? Let let us say a brief farewell. I eagerly anticipate seeing you on the stage. So it looks like we can actually join the musicals if we wanted. Oh, I don't know what to do. The musical would be totally cool, but there's so much stuff I want to do. Okay, that's okay. I've made my mind. I'm going to go and see the sights of New Bassa. See you later, Dan. So we can go and do that if we want. We're not going to, because I feel like it's not my cup of tea. Oh, what the hell is this? Is that a dad? Here it is, Daddy. What are you doing here? I've come to take you back home, of course. Your mother told me that you made it all the way out here. Haven't you gone far enough? No way! I'm going to keep traveling with Dan and my Pokemon. Bringing me into this now, isn't it? Absolutely not. Others do things their way, and we do ours. Is that so? Then, how about you You do things your way, and I'll do things my way? Well, she's only 16, so she's not actually a legal age. Well, in Pokemon she is. Sweetie, you keep going on travels. Oh my god. Hey, who do you think you are? This is for family matter. So a random person we've just met is getting involved with this. What the hell? My name is Elsa. I'm this, gym leader, gym, I'm the t this town gym leader. So she is the person who, for the dream I mentioned earlier, I am always happen to. Be, I also happen to be a model. You, you know, there are many people in this world. There are people whose way of thinking may be completely different to yours. Sometimes that means you may get hurt. Of course, that's exactly right. It's because I'm worried about that. But it's important to keep trying to learn differences between yourself and others. To learn that being different is okay. You shouldn't worry. Trainers have all Pokemon. Uh, trainers always have Pokemon at their side. Pokemon are wonderful. If if it's not only how cute they are, but how much you can depend on them. I just want to say something really quickly. This music is really nice. It's really chill. I like it. Please. I know there's going to be some painful stuff like that you're worrying about. I know. I really get it. But listen, there's tons of nice people too. What? No, what What else? Since I've been traveling with Pokemon, I've gone tougher. I can totally tell. So please. Oh, come on, Dad. Let her. Hmm, I guess. If you wanted to continue a journey, it's, it's a selfish on your... It, journey. It is self, selfishness on your part. Wanting to stop you is selfish on mine. Okay, that makes sense. I'm surprised to find I'm the only one being challenged at my age. The Dimulator's comments... Help me wake up. Bianca, I'm sure it's better that you take your path you want to take now. I hope your journey will be fun. Bon voyage. Dan, please, take care of my little girl, okay? Oh my god, this is so emotional, like, got a little tear in my eye. So nice. Papa, I'll come home after I find out what I really want to do. I'm sure he traveled as a trainer himself in the past. Being a parent must be hard. It actually must be, like, I've, I've not really ever felt it. Did I meddle unnecessary? You look troubled, so I decided to chime in. 
By the way, if you your trainers, please stop by the Pokemon Gym. I'll teach you something about being how tough a journey actually is. Okay, bye. What's oh, so sweet? She's so cool. Haha. <laughs> I want to be a total cool woman like Elsa. Yeah, Elsa. Hmm. I wonder how to get there. Well, before that, I guess I need to go and discover what I really want to do. See you later, Dan. That was really deep. Really, really deep. So what we're going to do is first of all, go and uh, look for a certain house. I can't where it is. What's this here? Smaller cut. Okay, we're going to explore that later on. What's over here? Let's have a little exploration because I don't want to fight the gym this episode because like, I feel like the, the gym would just be like, frozen into the deep end. Okay. Oh my god. What is this? What's, what's this? Rule 5. These Pokemon usually help me big today. I'm going to help battle you. Okay. Buy me, bro. Buy me. Fine, buy me. You're going down, bro. You're going down. I'm yelling, Timber. Let's go for a little water pulse. I know what's over here, but we might as well get this done because like, I feel like we're the adequate level to actually fight these guys. So Daco gained some experience. So did um, good old Dusty. Find a Pan Sage. We're gonna stay in. Just do the fact that we're gonna go for a quick Razor Shell. It's probably not gonna one hit, but it's gonna do a decent chunk of damage. See, Bice not gonna do too much. I'm sure he doesn't go for like its elemental move like Grass because it would have done some crazy damage to Daco. But I'm not going to judge him, and of course, I'm going to send in a Pampor, which we're going to stay in, and we're just going to go for another Razor Claw, I think, yeah. It's not going to do too much damage, but it will help out. As you can see, our physical attack is pretty good for Daco. I'm pretty happy with how Daco actually fights. And there we go, that's another attack. Well, hey, Pampor fainted, and we've got 100 and some experience. Yeah. We bait a Baker. you got a nice pair of buns, love. Badunch. And hello. Hmm, I'm a humble maid. My master has a big heart and much a big belly. So I'm looking for ingredients that will make my heart jump for joy. Mmm, that room, it smells so gourmet. Do you have any wonderful ingredients in your bag you would like to cook this me? Do you want the dowsing machine? Hmm, that's not quite what I'm looking for. Oh, I wanted to sell the dowsing machine. She might have wanted it, but I guess not. What's up here? Oh, there's, there's a train up here as well. Jesus Christ. I'm not complaining, like. The this big bag. What do you think's inside? Um, I hope you're on about the one on your back. But then, sh <laughs> And of course, some Mooners, because you can't go on with Mooners. Who doesn't like a bit of Mooners? But yeah, we're going to go into Tadako and go for a quick Razor Claw, Razor Shell, or whatever it is. And this should probably one hit. Just look how powerful Daco is. I'm so happy with how, how powerful he's actually getting like, in a short space of time. So what we're going to do is we're going to go and quickly go to the bag. I'll tell you a secret, it's very heavy or whatever. Let's go to the bag. I'm going to put on a Super Repel. Because I don't want to deal with this that is Pokemon Wells. We're going over here. Let's get a good old Super Repel on. And let's uh, actually interact with this. What is it? A great ball, not a bad item. I'm happy with it. I'm happy. I'm happy. Okay, what's over here? Okay, there's more Pokemon stuff. I feel like I'm gonna go this way and circle back round. As as my mind roams, as the wind blows, Destiny has brought me to this battle. Okay, pretty deep stuff. I'm not gonna lie. So in the town to the right, there's actually something called a Battle Institute where you can actually have five consecutive single or double battles to in you in a rank, and. Uh, then you get a score if completing all five, depending on your performance. I'm not going to show that off, but it's called the Ballot Institute if you really want to check it out. I feel like that would take a full episode in itself, and I really don't want to do that. So I'm, I'm really not going to waste my time doing that. I hope you guys can understand that. Uh, it's, it's just one of those things I really just don't want to show it off. Because it's, it's kind of like, there's no real, yeah, things to do. So, uh, I'm also not going to show off the Battle Stadium on the small court. These are just like, general um, football, soccer, you know, stuff. Uh, but it's where you have double battles, and you can go there every day. Uh, and the number of trainers and their levels actually increase. Oh, balls! I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Oh my god, we can actually go there, can we? Can we go there? Strawberry's up. Okay, it looks like we have to go to uh, Clay first, it says. And then, okay, that makes sense. I just want to go back and get that item. So it's like we're going to go and fight these guys first. But there's a few things I am going to be missing in this uh, area, just because like, I feel like it would take too long. I don't really enjoy doing it. Like, like I always mention, I do stuff I enjoy. And if I don't really enjoy it, I'm not going to do it. But yeah, we'll find a Sigilyph. As you can see, Sigilyphs are becoming a lot more common now, which I'm not complaining. You may be thinking, why am I using Daco all the time as well? Because the next gym, Daco's not going to excel in. So I'm kind of like, I want to get him at least a decent level so that he can excel. For, for the near future, you know what I mean? It's all about um, long-term goals. But, uh, oh my god, this music's pretty deep, isn't it? Turn around, turn around, it's my turn. Okay, fine by me, let's turn the speed up. And he's a break dancer, and he's gonna have Darumaka, which of course Daco is gonna excel it again. I still want Dusty to evolve. One of these days, Dusty's gonna get like that close to evolution, and when he does, uh, when she does, I'm gonna be absolutely buzzing because she deserves it, you know. Ooh, Spark! Yes. How much damage does Shockwave have? 
60, how much does Spark have? Oh, balls, no. I didn't, I didn't get to check. Uh, I forget. Okay, how much damage does Spark have? 65. I feel like we're gonna get rid of Shockwave, just because, like, it does 5 damage extra. It's gonna add up, you know what I mean? And with the upcoming gym, because it is specialized in Thunder, because we've learned that by Elsa, or whatever her name is, I feel like the more damage we get, the better. And when we get that HM, which I don't know what it is, I've got a feeling it's gonna really help out, so uh, I'm looking forward to that. Goodbye, Brian. You lost, bruh. You lost. Are you gonna fight me? Are you gonna fight me? Do you wanna fight me? The Pokemon the performance are amazing. Are you gonna fight me? Nope. Are you gonna fight me? Oh. Hmm, fierce, my battle song. Battle fiercely. Or something or other. Okay, okay. And we're fighting Preston, the musician. And he's gonna send in a Blitzel. Okay, I've got a feeling Dako's gonna die now because Blitzels are pretty fast. But we'll see. Oh my god, we're actually faster. We might be able to one-hit this. Oh my god, Dako, you bossed it there. You bossed it. And another Blitzel. Guess what we're gonna go for? A quick swipe. Yeah. So, but yeah, like I mentioned with the big stadium and the small court, it is done daily, so you can just keep returning and get some experience. And the margin badges to get the more experience uh, and the more Pokemon they have. Ooh, we got uh, an electric guitar? Is that a, a prop or something? Oh, yeah, it is a prop, okay. It sounds cool. Are you gonna fight me? Be able to bit Pokemon or whatever. This guy's gonna fight me because he's a street Pokemon. I'll show you all the moves that my Pokemon have mastered. Okay, fine by me. Show me what you got. Show me your moves. Show me your. Ooh, a Whirlipede. Okay, Daco's definitely gonna die. <laughs> he's not gonna be able to one shot um, a bug type. I don't, I don't think. Especially with Protect. But we can try. We can try. Uh, what we're gonna do is probably gonna go into Dusty after this so Dusty can get some more experience. Because she's gotta be getting close to evolution. Oh my god, Daco. I am shocked how powerful Daco's getting. He's getting a bit too overpowered for my liking. I'm not complaining, but Jesus Christ. The damage he's doing right now, it's ridiculous. Let's go for a War Pulse 3 out of uh, Razor Claw, hit PP. My god, Daco, you actually. He's actually owning. Revenge. I'm gonna keep all moves. Revenge actually does double damage after they've attacked you. It's not really the ideal for me, because I, I don't like using it, because actually you have to take a hit before you can actually do anything. Uh, but uh, let's head north and actually get these items we've missed, because I like the items. I also want to kind of experiment with the whole pot thing. You know, when I try to give her the, uh, the the dowsing machine. Ooh, a free revive. I'm not complaining about that. Free revives are great. It's going to be a TM, probably. A zinc. Yep, so worth it. Zinc's like, if I really have to sell that's still like 5k for free. Repel effect just wore off at the right time. Cool. Let's go and actually give her this something. By the way, um, if you really want to get repelled, go for super repels. The next adaptation of it is not worth the money, but I probably will buy it anyway. So let's have a look what we got. I guess it's going to be berry based. So let's, let's give some chest up berries. It's not so good. Chest berries yours. Uh, would you like 23? No! What? Rip off, man. Rip off. Is anything down here? Let's have a look. Anything down here? Anything down here? This. Oh, there is. Hey, no way. A free hyper potion. Not complaining. So I want to do one more thing, and then I think what we're going to do is going to end the episode. Because, like, it's been a pretty long one. So uh, let's head over here and uh, see what's actually happening. Because there's got to be something over here. You just got to believe. Okay. So what we're looking for is a certain building at the um, Battle Institute. Because we haven't actually been there. But I'm pretty sure there's going to be a balance shoot somewhere. It's actually the balance shoot. Is this the balance shoot? Is this the balance shoot? Battle Subway. Hmm. Is this the balance shoot? Yes, it is. So it's, this is the balance shoot, which is where you can actually like take the battle test, double battles and stuff. But what you want to come is come to is a house up here, this one right here, and this is going to be where you're going to get um, HMO4 from this guy right here. Your powerful man is going to give us HMO4, which allows us to use strength outside. Of, well, but we can't use it outside of battle because you need a fourth gym, uh, which is going to be useful on Route 16 for what he said. But I think the first time to end up the episode. So, if you enjoyed this video, please give a like, it would be appreciated. Next time on Let's Play Pokemon Black and White, we're gonna go and head to the amusement park, which I think is over here. Is it over here? No, it's not, actually. It's not. I got it wrong. Which is gonna be down here and to the right. So yeah, like I said, if you enjoyed this video, please give a like, it would be appreciated. Next time on Let's Play Pokemon Heart Goals, we're gonna go to the amusement park, which happens to be right next door over here. I shall see you guys then. Peace.